Hello and welcome back to another episode of Cooking with Hen Homes. Today we are gonna make a cheesy, saucy, delicious zucchini pizza casserole. So if you are low carbonate, keto style, this is perfect for you. However, it doesn't matter. No matter what <laughs> diet or eating habits, <laughs> eating habits, <laughs> it's good for anyone. So, all right, we're excited. For the ingredients, you need four cups of shredded unpeeled zucchini, half teaspoon of salt, two large eggs, one half cup grated Parmesan cheese, two cups shredded mozzarella cheese, one cup shredded cheddar cheese, one pound of ground beef, half cup of chopped onions, one can of Italian tomato sauce, and one medium green or sweet red pepper. Preheat oven to 400 degrees. Place zucchini in a colander, sprinkle with salt, and let stand for 10 minutes, then squeeze out the moisture. Combine zucchini with eggs, parmesan, and half the mozzarella and cheddar cheeses. Press into a greased 13 by nine inch baking dish and bake for 20 minutes. Meanwhile, in a large saucepan, cook beef and onion over medium heat until the meat is no longer pink, breaking the meat into crumbles and draining. Add tomato sauce and spoon over the zucchini mixture. Sprinkle with remaining cheeses and add the green pepper. Bake until heated, which is about 20 minutes longer. All right, this is what it looks like. It smells and looks delicious. Cheesy, amazing goodness. All right, dig in. Mmm, -hmm. mm -hmm. It's very so good. good. Make this. <laughs> it was really easy to make. Yeah, I mean, and it's not really that watered. No, no. Make make sure you know you you salt the zucchini. Let it rest for 10 minutes. The salt brings out the water in the zucchini, and then um, you want to kind of pull all the excess, excess moisture out of it with paper towels or a thin dish towel um, is the best way to go. I had a, an idea that I might try um, next time. So you put the zucchini mixture in, as you know, first, you come back and then you top it with the meat. I was thinking it might be nice to add a ricotta mixture Bake the zucchini, do a thin layer of like a ricotta mixture, then the ground beef, mm -hmm. kind of make it a like little bit different, a little more like lasagna with yeah, that ricotta. Yeah. So I might try that sometimes, but this is so, so good. good and I suggest that you make it. Yep. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. Well, so signing off so I can finish uh, <laughs> devouring this. <laughs>